Hi guys, today we have a guest, Nenad Shuput from uh, a Serbian guy that lives in the US uh, from Salt Lake City, Utah. And today he's going to show us a half guard pass because a half guard is a very usual position in MMA and sometimes it can get hard to pass. So he has a nice solution for that. Today he'll be working with my student Marco and uh, he's, he's going to show you. Okay, I call this half pass more than a half guard. The bottom guy being in a half, it's more of an advantage to me, unless he's a really skillful jiu-jitsu player, which in MMA, it's a little bit rarer to come across. So, this is what we do, my approach to this. Let's say we went down with the single, however, and I get in a half pass. Okay, his goal is to tuck in and come under me. When he's under me, he is my balance, and he can do whatever he wants with me. So. My first goal is to concentrate where the problem is. Problem is right here in his hips and legs. This is not a problem yet, unless he comes under. So the first thing I want to do is I want to come to the problem. I come to it and I can put my head in straight here. I don't want to pass it here for guillotine. I don't want to guillotine. Straight here. Once I'm here is when I go either elbow in for underhook or I can go uh, palm in to block here. Once I'm here, I switch my stance. I switch from this hip, because I'm leaning on it, to this hip. By putting this knee and blocking the hip right here. This is what I do. I block, and I come here. Now, what's important here? If I just stay here, he has all this. Yeah. The first thing I do, I tuck the head and lift his hips. Tuck the head, and I lift his hips. See how his hips are on my leg? This is what I want. Now, it's much harder for him to work. Even if he goes here, I'm here. Go, go put me back. Put me back, put me back. It won't work because of this, okay? Now I can go here, here, and I pull this leg. See how this stretches it? Let's say he has it locked. Like, it's really locked. Now I use this pull against him. Boom! And I have a mat. And let's say he's smart, and he does not commit to this hold. I stretch and I kick, and I scoop up, and now I have to side, north, south, or I have a thread for a mount, and then I walk from there. Great, can you show me the, the variation uh, where you pull on the leg when, once he locks up? Okay, so we are here, head in, and I switch my hip, lifting his. When I pull on the leg, right here, and let's say he, he clamps down and he pushes it. I pull, pull, when I feel the power, uh, the pressure go that way, is when I release, and I kick my knee to myself. And that's when I have the mouth. Right, what about the other one when you actually kind of like to do a leg oh, lock? Oh, yes. Right here, boom. Let's say none of these things work. He's really, really into it, nothing works. Look what I have. What's given to me? Boom! A foot. I go here first. I make a lever against his knee with my wrist up. Right here. Let's say he's really tough. It doesn't work. I put his hip in and I go here. And I pull. I can finish here. I can go additionally. Once I start pulling here, see? Like he gets really tucked. I can go here and reach under. Now, I have this foot lock. Wow, nice. This foot lock, this foot lock, and he kicks it. Oh, I kick. I have this control. Oh. Okay, so thank you very much, Nenad. If anybody wants to train MMA in the Salt Lake City area, I highly recommend Nenad. Can you tell us something more about your academy, the name, the location? The location, uh, location is Salt Lake City, Utah. Uh, 33rd South, 2nd East, uh, by the Century 16 and new Pizza Pie. I want to shout out to my black belt coach from Brazil, Gustavo Rodriguez, and SLC Muay Thai Gym in Salt Lake City. Let's go, guys. Uh, website? Uh, SLC Muay Thai uh, uh, in the Facebook. Okay. So let's put SLC Muay Thai. We have a wrestling program there with uh, Division I wrestler, wrestler from Iowa State. Cole Schaefer, and many great other great guys there as well. 
Great. Thank you very much for showing it, for showing the technique. Guys, if you like more videos from me, uh, subscribe to the channel. And if you'd like to take your MMA training further, check out my instructionals. I will see you again in another video very soon.